I am Timo Somers. I am 21 years old, born in Holland. I've been playing in, uh, in a lot of bands, touring around the world, recording albums, and uh, it is my passion. I can't fully express myself with words and, and you know, stuff like normal people do. When I grab a guitar, I think I can show all my emotions and everything, let it all out. My name is Aristides Sport, and we're here at the factory of Aristides Instrument. We're located at the beautiful city of Haarlem, the Netherlands. It has been a love relationship uh, since I was uh, quite young. It's such an amazing cultural icon, the, the, the guitar and electric guitar. My background is engineering and I've always been interested in the engineering side, the designing side and of course also the musical side of this whole uh, story. For me it's just a mix you know, of arts, crafts, engineering, software. I was working already with, uh, with Pete C. Creo and I met somebody and uh, he said to me, well, I, I, I'm working on this guitar, but it cannot be drawn in a computer because it's a hand sanded model. It's very complicated shape. It cannot be done. And it challenged me and I, I said, I can do that. When I first saw Nout with the software, I thought, hey, who's that nerd over there? We know what it was to, to, to do all this handwork and all this, you know, this, this tedious building, because it's really sort of a difficult process. And now with PC Creo, when I first saw it, it was like uh, my eyes popped out. The big difference between a wooden guitar and this guitar is that it, it comes out of a mold, an aluminium mold. And this mold, you, you cannot change it, it has to be perfect. So you have to engineer everything in the computer till, till the last uh, thousands of a millimeter. You can stitch these surfaces continuously together. And that's a very important tool for me with P2C Creo. The computer model as a starting point is 100% copied into the mold. There is no difference between the computer model and the actual guitar. So this guitar is really dynamic and you know you can express yourself in many ways. And you can turn it up a little bit. And you can also just, you know, hard work riff on it. Timo's a real virtuoso uh, par excellence. He's uh, like a, a magician on the strings. Or you can just go freaky with it. And then go back to the whatever. Starting with an idea about the guitar, going into a design, going into a computer drawing, and actually with a lot of craftsmanship, going into the hands of the artist, it's pretty amazing to see. I played all over the world with this guitar. The fan response is always really good. They tell me like design is really, really cool. And uh, uh, for me, the best thing is if they say like, it sounds amazing, what is it? I think it, it, it has improved my playing uh, in the way that I can fully express myself, uh, especially in a live situation. It's the main motivation of the whole journey. I mean, when you have somebody pick up your product and create this music with it, I mean, what better things can you do on this planet? I think classics are played by heroes, but maybe it's time to make new heroes with new different guitars. And then it maybe becomes classic on its own. God. <laughs>